Hi everybody, my name is Anastasia and welcome to my YouTube channel. This video is going to be me prepping for a little Stranger Things watching, which is tomorrow. So today's Thursday, tomorrow volume two of season four comes out on Netflix. I'm very excited. If they kill Steve, I will riot. I went grocery shopping today for all the charcuterie bits but I'm gonna set everything up for the sh actual charcuterie board tomorrow. What I wanted to do today was I wanted to bake some like no-bake cookies. I found a recipe for banana oatmeal no-bake cookies. So I figured I would make the cookies tonight. Hopefully before I go to bed, they'll be solidified so I can like put them in a box and they'll be easier to store. Just found the recipe on my Notion. The first step is to mash the bananas in a mixing bowl until they're nice and creamy. So let's do that. So basically then it says to line a cookie sheet, dollop them on and then put them in the freezer. I can't do that. I'm going to dollop them on a plate and then I'm going to put them in the fridge. And that is just going to have to work. I divvied it up. I probably could have made them smaller to be honest, but I just don't have the space. So this plate is really full and this one too. So this made about 17 cookies. So I'm just gonna try to put them in the fridge. Fingers crossed. And then I'm gonna clean. What I'm gonna do next to kind of prep for tomorrow is I wanted to set up the little, the lights with the A, B, C, D. So I think I'm gonna put it above my bed because I have this wall space for it. Um, I'm gonna take that poster down. I went and I hunted high and low for colorful lights, but it's the wrong season and I couldn't find any. So I'm just gonna use normal little twinkly lights. I got the letters printed. So I'm just gonna sit here and cut them out while I watch Parks and Rec. We're fast forwarding. Today is Friday. Happy Stranger Things season four, volume two day. I'm very excited. I'm gonna start setting up my charcuterie board. I don't have like a fancy big plate type of thing. So I'm gonna do it on my cutting board. What I did yesterday was I went grocery shopping and now that I'm looking at everything, I realize I have a lot of stuff. I have a selection of cheeses. So I bought Gruyere. I don't know if I'm gonna say any of these right. Ida, Brie and Borson. I bought like a selection of berries. So I have raspberries, blueberries, strawberries. I had blackberries, so I might use those. And then I also bought cherries because so fun. And figs. I love using figs. Well, I first of all, just love eating figs, but figs are delicious. Like a little selection of um, salami. I also bought some prosciutto. So basically I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut the pieces in half and then I'll do like a little prosciutto situation on the charcuterie board and then also i bought a cantaloupe because i wanted to do cantaloupe and prosciutto together because if you have not had that it is absolutely delicious and you definitely need to and then i think i'm just gonna fill in all of the other little gaps with like i have some almonds and cashews and like mango like um, dried mango and banana chips and stuff so i think i'm just gonna kind of like I want it to look really full and really pretty, so we'll see. Oh, okay, also, I really wanted to try to make a salami rose. Like, will that be cute? Will it look weird? I don't know. I'm gonna just start, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Hi, beautiful girl. I just finished putting together the charcuterie board. I filmed some of it and then my battery died. So basically what I did is I started off with the cheeses. I cut some of them. The borsin, I just put the entire thing on there because it's a creamy one. And then I made the salami roses. So cute. And then basically I kind of just started working my way in. Just like little bits here and there. So I'll show you 
what it looks like. I think it turned out really nice. I like those like beautiful cluttered ones that you kind of see on Pinterest and stuff. So I think this is very cute. And it really just like, it works for me. I'm loving it. So I'm really excited to dig into that. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna cut up the cantaloupe and then wrap those pieces in prosciutto. And then that's kind of it, I think. Oh, and then I'll cut the bread and put that into a bowl. And then I'm kind of just, I'm gonna wrap this up and put it back in the fridge because I'm not having it again for maybe another hour and a half. So I have about half an hour. So I'm gonna set everything up because I think that everything's been sitting in the fridge for a while and I think it's better to serve the cheese when it's like room temperature so it tastes better. So I'm just gonna set everything up on my little table here. I'm so excited and I'm so happy with the way that this turned out. I think it's really cute, especially considering it was my first time making one. I'm just gonna turn these lights on. Yeah, that's really cute. Oh, I'm so excited. Anyways, this was my prepping for Stranger Things, making a charcuterie board, doing the whole thing. Um, I really hope you guys liked it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe. I'm gonna leave my social media links in the down bar and yeah. Happy Stranger Things!